Well, I'm excited to see what the diamonds look like that have been found here recently at Southwest Arkansas's famous Crater of Diamonds State Park. There's a brown one. Pretty good. Uh, on Tuesday, September 10th, a Haynesville, Louisiana guest registered a six-point white diamond. I wonder if that could be Danny Dana. I'm not sure where in Louisiana he lives. Uh, on Tuesday, September 10th, a Millington, Tennessee guest registered a 25-point white diamond. Now, that's one quarter of a carat. There's a picture of it. Uh, unique shape, 25-pointer, a uh, quarter of a carat. On Wednesday, September 11th, a Murfreesboro guest registered an 8-point white. That, that might have been David Anderson. I don't know. But admissions just $15 for ages 13 and up. On Wednesday, September 11th, a Lone Oak, Arkansas guest registered an eight-point brown. I'm pretty sure that was Jeff Peake. Oh, that's a lovely six-point white on the right there. On Wednesday, September 11th, a Haynesville, Louisiana guest registered a ten-point brown diamond. There are a hundred points of weight per carat, so that's a tenth of a carat. I love that quarter carat white there. Unique shape. 497 diamonds have been found so far this year as of September 11th. And that's the latest information we have posted by the State Park. 36,585 diamonds have been found at this site since it became a State Park 52 years ago in 1972. On Tuesday, September 10th, a Derrick's Arkansas guest registered a two-point white diamond, and I'm sure that's Scott Krakus. On Tuesday, September 10th, a Fayetteville, West Virginia guest registered a four-point white diamond, and I'm sure that's Larry Taylor. He comes all the way from Fayetteville, West Virginia. That's a long trip. On uh, Tuesday, September 10th, a Haynesville, Louisiana guest registered a four-point white diamond. Look at that Kareem diamond, a, a 7.46 carat brown found by a, a man from Paris, France. On Tuesday, September 10th, a Haynesville, Louisiana guest registered a four-point white diamond. There's a four-point white that may be the one that he found, and that may be Dana Dan Danny Dana. Great, thank you. On uh, Tuesday, September 10th, Larry Taylor of Fayetteville, West Virginia, registered a three-point white diamond. On Tuesday, September 10th, a Haynesville, Louisiana guest registered a six-point white. On Tuesday, September 10th, a Millington, Tennessee guest registered a 25-point white diamond, quarter carat. And I think that's about all the information. I think we're going around again. Boy, that's a pretty six-point white. What a lovely shape. Yes, I remember the Murfreesboro man finding an eight-point white. So uh, that's all the information for now. Thank you for catching up with the latest news. Uh, please, oh boy, I like that 25 point white. Uh, please like our photos and uh, subscribe to our page, Genuine Diamonds in AR. Thank you.